now we saw uh, we talked about uh, the first element of learning analytics which is the data we saw the sources uh, we talked about what kind of data will you get and you know how designing an e-learning course to gather those touch points is very very important now data in itself uh, isn't sufficient for you to gain those actionable insights, of course. So you have to aggregate and correlate those raw data in it to be able to find those actionable in insights. That's exactly the process of analysis, which is also the second very important element of learning analytics. Uh, so the more sophisticated your process is, uh, the better insights you will get from your data. Now, uh, you know, it can be done manually, but it will be a daunting process, especially when it comes to complex analysis. So, you know, when uh, in this case, you can have a separate learning analytics tool uh, as a standalone uh, to, the, to do the job for you, to gather the data for you, to analyze the data for you, or also you can have, uh, you know, an additional plugin uh, tied up with your LMS to do the job for you. 